My name is Mark Lynch, I'm an MEP Associate at uh, Condal and we're here today to bring the minds of the industry together to discuss future-proofing existing buildings in the UAE. I see that Dubai is coming up um, with an unescapable need to do engineering retrofits. Therein lies the opportunity of bringing in the modern day best practices that you see in, in the new buildings as you said and applying it to these retrofits and improving the efficiency of the aged buildings. Changes happening from the tenant on their internal policies and strategies related to environmental sustainability, well-being and etc. Changing quicker than constructing a building. So that means the supply will be shrinking day by day and the old building need to take a quick action and retrofit their existing systems. From a sort of fit out point of view, the main challenges we see are really budget you know, commercial, financial, and convincing clients of that return on investment. We need really to digitalize our buildings. Yeah? Like what we are doing in our processes, like what we are doing in our personal life, digitalizing everything. Yeah? We need really to also look at the building as a human being yeah? and digitalize the building. It's really important that the industry understands how critical it is to act now. At this stage, we don't have the next decade to wait around. We've got to really start thinking about the measures we can apply today and the roadmap towards progression and improvement. Do you think that we're going to catch up and overtake some of those targets because of the new generation? Even if the next generation are very well educated about this, but it's going to be too late. I've talked about the decarbonisation rate. When you say this needs to be multiplied five times, five times is not just a walk in the park. This is something extremely aggressive. We are all responsible for what's happening. There is a liability on our shoulders and this generation to take a proper decisions as fast as possible and also to provide the entire awareness to the community. This issue needs to be faced and it needs to be faced now. It's going to be impactful for the next five to 20 years. Credit to you guys in Condell for actually seeing that this kind of discussions and the round table needs to happen now.